Postscriptum. I do have a serious ongoing interest in uh, medical sciences, especially in uh, blocking disease spread. For example, in some regions of the world, pathogenic agents can be as small as mosquitoes, and that aspect did get me curious and baffled at the same time when I was in school. I think we are able to abstract questions like, A. How do these insects communicate between them? Where do they congregate? How exactly do they congregate between them? A question of insect protocol. B. How do they behave? What is it that they do, really? What is exactly their style of motion in an environment? Where do they feed from? What is it these insects need in terms of food and reproduction? Questions of interaction, mostly with uh, non-insects. C. How do they communicate with non-insects? Is it right to assume for this particular game only two types of animals, of uh, both genders, insects and non-insects? If you are right to assume only these uh, four cases, maybe six cases if we are to be a little loose here, then that fact is good because it implies good uh, tractability results. Keywords. A. Information dissemination. Rumor spread versus broadcasting. Insects could broadcast if we want to make it interesting or not. Non-insects communicate and broadcast too, yet I think it would be pretty safe to assume insects have access to these messages. So we can see the problem of blocking disease is already highly non-trivial. B. Wasp colony computation. For example, how far do insects travel? Do they have companions? Do they shuffle with non-insects regularly? C. Predator-prey dichotomy. How is it that they attack? Is it only through chemicals, pheromones and so on? Or is it right to assume fatal bite capabilities too?